Welcome to TPF Scopes. Today we are discussing about strengthening of assault rifle manufacturing industry under Make in India. Israel transfers assault rifle technologies to India. Israel Weapon Industries, IWI, has set up a joint venture with an Indian partner to manufacture small arms, including assault rifles, from this year. This is in line with the Indian government's efforts to persuade foreign arms makers to share technology and make the products under the Make in India program. I will has tied up with India's Punjloy to manufacture small arms including assault rifles, such as Tavar 21 and Galil, under technology transfer arrangement. Punjloy has inaugurated a plant in central India with the help of I when the production of small arms will begin here this year. We have done a joint venture with iWind we have set up a plant for manufacturing assault rifles, carbines, light machine guns and snipers in our plant. This is a joint venture with technology transfer arrangement to India, Asha Kwadwan, President, Manufacturing Business, Defense and Aerospace, at Punch Lloyd Limited told Sputnik. Punch Lloyd will manufacture 5.56 by 45 m Taver assault rifles that can fire up to 950 rounds per minute, an X95 short weapon with a long barrel, 3 caliber weapon having 360 degrees Picani rail. Apart from assault rifles, the joint venture will also manufacture semi automatic Negev. 5.56 by 45 m and 7.62 by 51 m assault light machine gun and 7.62 by 51 m semi-automatic Galil sniper rifles. The Galil sniper fires up to 1,000 meters, targeting small, mobile or concealed objectives. Punch Lloyd has set its eye on the Indian Army's plan to purchase 185,000 assault rifles with telescopic sights in future. However, the company expects the joint venture to make it big in all the procurement plans of armed forces related to small arms. It is basically for Make in India program. Right now we are not targeting just one product line here. All the small arms products, which are needed for the armed forces, we would manufacture, Wada and added. Punch Lloyd has invested approximately $52 million in defense manufacturing and has invested $4 million for this particular business. The investment amount would keep increasing depending on the order size which we keep getting, he said. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi is expected to visit Israel this July to mark the 25th anniversary of joint diplomatic relations. Modi's visit, which will be the first ever by an Indian Prime Minister, could yield some more defense deals between the two countries including armed Heron TP drones and Falcon radar systems. The Indian government signed a contract worth more than $1.6 billion with Israeli arms firm EAI. Over the last three years, India has signed 10 defense contracts with Israel, which is second only to Russia.